Well, since uh, smooth pleasing isn't here, I'm going to uh, sit here with my good, uh, with the FTW uh, promoter extraordinaire, Chris Castle. That's right, Insane Lane. What a night of action we've had here in Fayetteville. Yes, we've had. Yes, we have. Great card from top to bottom, and now we're going to get the first of two title defenses when Cabana Man Dan takes on the one and only Mike Quackenbush. Lightning Mike Quackenbush is, of course, the IWA Deep South champion. Right. Cabana Man Dan, well loved all over the Alabama Indy area. I guess he's worked for pretty much every North Alabama period. In the well, former, you know, I'd be a good South champion. He's so the very first. He was the inaugural. Actually, I've been told to uh, inform the crowd here. This, uh, since CMB never got his rematch for the injury, this is in fact his IWA Deep Cup rematch. Oh. Is, is that right? Yes. Yes. I was informed by the uh, the owner of IWA Deep South there. I'll tell you that. What's his name? Kevin Burnett is the owner. He's a management problem. Let's put it that way. And here comes one and only Mike Quackenbush today. On an immaculate belt he wears there. And an immaculate t-shirt he's wearing on Yes. Sporting the FCW banner there. Of course, that'll be June 12th in Elkmont, Alabama. Samoa Joe making his ID, ID, excuse me, FTW debut. That's right. I'll be there. People love the Cabana Man Dan. Pretty much a fan favorite everywhere he goes. They love the flip flops. Oak Grove. I'm going to kick you in the face for bringing that up. <laughs> World travel. Even the tree for gimmicks hates in there. This guy's been all over the world. I've been everywhere. Yes, he's been, he has been everywhere. One of the greatest technical wrestlers on the planet. wild side. Special bear. He's been everywhere. He also writes a monthly column for, uh, is it The Wrestler Magazine? I, believe so. yes. I was unaware of that. Yes. He, he, also, he, also, has, he also has a couple of books out. Yes. He's actually taking Bryant Gumbel's spot on the day show. <laughs> you heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. I actually heard he was taking Rosie's place on the, uh, on the beat. Yeah. Nah, I think Roseanne's got that. Okay, See him being in control. Watch Roseanne, the, the sitcom was very good. Though. Lightning quick. This should be quite a technical matchup with CMD. Actually, Insane Land, I believe tomorrow night you get a face off with uh, Commander Man Dan. But it's probably not going to be quite as technical though. Hey. Probably not. I'm the, I'm the world's greatest technical wrestler. Hey, y'all just don't know. You're the world's greatest wrestler in my opinion. Hey. All together. Hey. And I feel really close to you right now. Are you sure? Probably because we're packing more like sardines. Yes. I don't like sardines. Me either. It's Oh, nice foot though for Mike and Mike Quackenbush. Very snazzy, very snazzy. He's in control of CMB now. Oh, CMB, nice reversal there. This is uh, CMB's idol, definitely. Nice rolling combination there. Oh, he's going to get right back on that arm. Something Mike Quackenbush would be proud of. As he pointed out earlier, uh, Armour felt to do that. Arm bar, oh, little snap, marry him over, and maintain control. Yes. The crowd really kind of torn here, doesn't know who to cheer for. He was either trying to relieve the pressure or he had hands in his pants. Yes. And they made him do a boogie dance. Simon Diamond there with the multiple suplexes. Nice, nice channel moves there. Well, here. Referee Cowboy Troy looks to be in a wonderland. Is it a winter wonderland? It's probably spring here. It's very humid, I know that. Flip-flop hurts. The flip-flop's actually legal here at FTW. Why is that, Chris Castle? It's just like getting kicked with your hand. Oh, and he hit him with the other one. Oh! 
Hey, let him hit you in the ear, okay? That's all I have to say. Or kick you in the um, solar plexus. Yes. You think you'll get some of that action going on that instead? I probably will. And, uh, Good luck, though. I hope you come out on top. Because I have, you know, a best of interest in your career. Yes, you do. I can only hope for a barbed wire flip flop. Oh, my God. That would be no, that's Actually, not a bad idea. a thumbtack flip flop would be just incredible, too. Uh, I can't afford my flip flop. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty oh, sure he gets those at the dollar store. That's a look at that. See, they showing off some of his mat, mat yeah. training there. On the, uh... Good pressure. Good pressure on the show. Yes. See, CMD, of course, a, a, a master of studying uh, film of other wrestlers. See, many Mike Rackenbutcher matches. He's tying him up now. I can only admit. Oh. Oh, oh and he can't I've get been out. I've putting that before. Oh, no. Oh. oh. Using his own flip flop against him. Uh, you really, it's very hard to get out of that. It is so hard. Break it up. He's got he to tie him in knots. He tied him in knots. Okay, he's out now. CMD looks a little I, flustered. I, I, I've never seen CMD get showed up like this. CMB is pretty much uh, one of the better mat wrestlers here in the South, but uh, yes, he is. He's, this is a whole different level of like Matt Quackenbush. Look, they're bringing no more flip-flops. Pinky you swear. Mike, you consider Mike Quackenbush a man of his word? Yes. What's behind his back? His hand. Oh, there you go. Okay. I, I would have had a flip-flop behind mine. Yes. That would have been awesome. Walk up. See him in control. I keep it real. Off the ropes. Oh. Ducks. Oh. Oh, oh look, look at there. there. Like, outsmart Mike Quackenbush there. Yes. But you're not going to outsmart Mike Quackenbush for very long. Look at this. Oh, oh. wow. Mike uh, comes back there. Oh, twisting both arms. Looks like a mercy hold, if you will. Oh, look at this. He's a wow. magician. I mean, just Carl Castle back here. Big atomic drop, a stop on the foot, oh, and a leg sweep. Wow. Oh, oh double knee. Cover now. One, two. Two count. Now, Quacken well, Bush has got an arm bar on Cabana Man Dan. Whenever he does something too flashy, I just call him a magician and say he's mad. Magic like the car <laughs> song from Heartbeat City. I'm sorry. I don't even know. Bad 80s, right? A little before your time. I was, I was born in 84. Oh, we'll see. There you go.